Hello, my dear class. Hello, hello. Good evening, everyone. Good, good evening. How are you today? I'm very well. How about you? I am doing great. Very happy to be here and to see all of you. Welcome okay. to uh, this day. Welcome to your class. And we are going to have a very wonderful day today. We are going to go over the last topic of the book. We are also going to cover the conversations. We are going to have time for you to organize. Don't worry. I will give you some minutes for you to talk with your friends. And we are going to check on the platform that everything is done because I am sure that you have already finished, right? Yo creo que ya todos terminaron. Yes or no? Yes, right. Yes. Yeah, yes, I, yes, that, that's yes. something that it's already done. So we are going to be just checking on that, that everything is uh, done. And uh, we are going to have the presentations of the conversations, right? So welcome, everybody. We're going to start today by asking you one thing that you like about your day. What was nice about your day? I am going to share my day. I really like my day because I had the opportunity to go to pick up my son to school. And he was very happy when he saw me. He was like, Mama, hi, yay! We were just laughing there. It was very beautiful. So I went to pick up my son at school and that's something that I like about my day. What is What was nice about your day? Tell me one thing that was good about your day. Uh-huh. Only one. <laughs> Edgar, go ahead. Hi, teacher. Okay. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Hello. Hello, Jesus. Okay. Yes, okay. Edgar. My day was so very nice because we didn't have the water and and we went to get water to friends. Uh-huh. Yeah. It got <laughs> kind of tired, but we, we got got it. We, we, I mean, we we went to get water. Hey, that's so nice. Where did you go? I I went to my friends. Oh, Just you went? Okay. To, they gave me water to get water <laughs> in my house. <laughs> well, that's so that's nice, right? Yeah, that's good. Yeah, it is good. It it is really nice that you have these people who are always supporting you and helping you. So that's that's yeah. really beautiful. Excellent. So tell me about the rest of you. What was nice about your day? What did you like it? ¿Qué le gustó de su día? Um, my life is day. Uh, Go to uh, San Salvador. Here. You went to San Salvador. You went to San Salvador. And no, they say, I uh, went. A retirar. A yeah, a retirar. Uh -huh, a retirar what? A retirar mi licencia de conducir. Ah, I went to San Salvador to get my driver's license. Okay. My driver's license. My driver's my my driver license 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 license. Okay, so you came to San Salvador. So like I went to San Salvador to get my driver's license. Congratulations. Okay. Congratulations, Nidia. Now you are a legal driver of our country. Be careful. <laughs> uh huh. What about the rest? Tell me. What did you like about your day? ¿Qué le gustó de su día? No creo que no les haya gustado nada. Um, ¿no? um, spend with my yeah. family at work. At oh, work. Okay, to spend time with your family and for sure that you work. Very good. Let's see. Uh, who was ever? Go ahead. Uh, I like about my day that I enroll my, my subjects 
in the university without any problem. Hey, that's very good. So you enroll to your university subjects without any problem. Congratulations, congratulations. Mr. Jesus. Hello. Uh, this day teacher uh, was a very nice day because in the morning I call with my mother and uh, I'm very happy because my mother, uh, uh, he has a, a good health. Uh, she has um, 84 years old and the, um, his health is very important. Okay. And uh, in the afternoon, uh, um, I went to buy um, a pair of, of wheels for my for my cars uh, because I my wheels uh, uh, was uh, uh, was um, um, my my wheels uh, uh, doesn't doesn't good. Okay, uh, and then. And then police, uh, police. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's very they can, dangerous. They can, they can give you a ticket for that. In that case, okay, Jesus, you say that you took your mother to the doctor, yeah. right? But you say like her health, her health is good. Hair, because his is for men, right? Hair, ah, hair. Her okay. hair is good and she yeah. is yeah. fine. She is healthy, right? She, because ah, it's a lady. And crazy. You went to buy wheels for your car, and in that case, they are called tires. Tires. Ah, tires. Wheels. Are for, it's for the bicycle or for the for other mm. things like that, like llantitas, mm. right? Las la llantas. Mm. But mm. Uh, the most appropriate for the car is the tires, right? Okay. I went to buy new tires for the car. Okay. Good. I'm going to take note. Take note of that, please. So uh, that's really nice, right? It's pretty awesome that you did good things, right? Who ate something delicious today? Raise your hand if you ate something delicious. Yeah. Tell me, who enjoy at work? ¿Quién disfrutó su día en el trabajo? <laughs> like, me. <laughs> like me. The, <laughs> la mano en el suelo. <laughs> Anoteme, teacher. Bórreme. <laughs> okay, so let me see. Who listened to good music today? Me. Who watched TV today? <laughs> me. I watch TV. I I, 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 you didn't. No. I, I am not going to ask who took a shower because I know <laughs> Edgar had water. <laughs> <laughs> Sí tenía agua para la ducha. Okay, good, very good, my dear class. So let's move a little bit on the business. And uh, okay, Ceci, thank you for your message. And I am going to open my book, right? I am going to give you some minutes later for you to get together with your friends and talk about uh, the conversation, okay? So yesterday we started talking about the past models, right? Let me share my screen with all of you. And here it is. We were talking about the past models. What would you have done? What would you have done? And what should I have done? In this case, you use what would you have done? You are asking the person, right? He took you a hecho. And when you say, what should I have done? ¿Qué tendría que haber hecho yo? Right? The first question is for someone else. What would you have done? And what should I have done? ¿Qué podía haber hecho? ¿Qué debería haber hecho yo? Right? And the answer is like, you I would have told her to leave. I wouldn't have done anything. In this case, as you can see, you use the past participle form after would have. Right? I would have told. I would have done. And in the second one as well, you use the past participle. What should I have done? You should have spoken to her about it. You shouldn't have lied about it, right? So this is the form. The first one is for a second person. And the second question is for you. What should I have done? Imagine that you didn't finish the platform on time. 
And you know, because you were like procrastinating a little bit. Do you know what is the meaning of procrastinate? Posponer. Yes. You were procrastinating a lot, right? And you were saying, yeah, maybe tomorrow. Now nah, the next day, next Monday, teacher. Now nah, later. So when you are procrastinating, you are just leaving things for the last moment. So I will say, you shouldn't have wasted your time. You shouldn't have procrastinated that much. You shouldn't have, uh, I don't know, you shouldn't have... Uh, what used your time in other things, right? You should have worked on that, but it is done already. So you should have done, debería de haber hecho esto. But it is like an option when you say like, aha, uh -huh, what would you have done? ¿Qué habría hecho tú? I will have work every single day on it. I will have advanced on it uh, more than required. I wouldn't have spent uh, a lot of time doing other things, right? Those are the recommendations or the options that you could answer, right? Imagine that you lost your wallet in Metro Centro, but someone else found it. He saw you, but they didn't give it to you. What should they have done? ¿Qué tendrían que haber hecho? Si usted vio, ¿quién la votó? Mm -hmm. You should have given it back. That's the most correct thing, right? But what did you do? You shouldn't have checked it there. You shouldn't have taken the money. You should have given it back. That is what is correct, right? But from correct to, from the must to the do, yeah, it's a, like a big thing. I have here a couple of situations, right? I have here a couple of situations on which you have the action and for sure the result, but we are going to match them. We are going to match them. And we have the first one. Can you help me to read number one, people? The teacher. Borrowed. And it's spilled, it's spilled, it's like, Look, it spills coffee all over it. Parece chiste, pero es anécdota. Yes. One day, my literature teacher had her favorite book. And I loved the book. And I said, teacher Sonia, can you lend me your book? And she said, yes, 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 Nati, take it. I love to read. She gave me the book. So I took the book to my house. That day... It rained a lot, but rain and rain and rain. So my, my house just flowed with, with water, right? And my niece and my nephew were playing in my bedroom and they just dropped the book on the floor. The book got completely wet and it was my teacher's book. And when I got to my house, I saw the book totally wet and I was like, <laughs> Mejor batting me, please. Because it was my teacher's favorite book and I ruined it. So I called my father and I said, look for this book there because they didn't have it here in El Salvador. So my father found the book in the United States. He sent me the book and I took the new book to the teacher. And she told me, where is my book? And I said, no, teacher, mire que le quería traer este nuevo, que no sé qué. <laughs> and I was like, very ashamed, right? And she told me, tell me the truth. What happened to my book? And I said, <laughs> look. And I showed the book that it was all big and wet and horrible. And she said like, ay, Nati, you shouldn't have done that. You shouldn't have done all this process that you did. You shouldn't have spent the money. It's okay. And I was like, <laughs> okay. <laughs> you shouldn't have done that. Give me the old one. And she got the wet book and the new book. And she has them there in her office. <laughs> the university. Tiene el mojado feo arruinado and the new one next to them. But 
I said like, I should have asked before, right? Yo tendría que haberle preguntado antes. Before moving my parents, my father, the money, the spending. But she said, you shouldn't have done that. See, ¿Sí? Experiences. Así que cuando les pase un accidente, cuéntenlo primero. Tal vez no van a gastar nada. <laughs> the next one. And that's the first case. The teacher borrowed my favorite book and I spilled coffee all over it. What is the second situation? I saw. I saw a classmate cheering. I saw on a classmate So I wrote her a letter about it. I saw a classmate cheating on a letter about it. Okay. Hello, Cesar. How are you? Number three, a friend of mine. Friend of mine. Always has hair. Okay. Oh, okay. So I gave. Oh, okay. Nice gift. Hey. Yeah. The <laughs> Yeah. It is like when 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 people have these smelly parts of the body and you give a deodorant. <laughs> for a birthday, oh. or a perfume, right? For the birthday. A comb for his birthday. Okay. Situation number four. I hit someone in car. When I was living in a parking lot. Lastly, no one saw me. No one, no one, saw, me. No no one, one saw me. Yeah, nowadays with cameras all over, there is no possibility. And number five, my aunt, my aunt, my aunt, my for my birthday, for my birthday, I don't I gave it back to her, right? A cigarette lighter, <laughs> my God, and I don't smoke, he says. So we have the options here. And let's read the options and then we're going to match them. What is option A? You, you should have you should spoken have to him about, about it. it. You should have you spoken know. to him about it. No, okay, the next one, letter B. Uh, I, I have number one. I have something else. I will have told her that I prefer something else. What is option C? I will have a letter. Okay, we're going to match them in a moment. Letter D. I will have a letter for the owner to come back. For the owner to come back. And letter E. Number four. You, you should, you should you have, have a change, change, change for something. You should have a change. It Letter F. I wouldn't I have said anything. anything. I say anything. I wouldn't have said anything. Letter G. Not to do it again. And the last one. I hit your car. Sorry. Bye. <laughs> and you put the, the note. <laughs> like, Bye. <laughs> Sorry. So there you go. Yeah. <laughs> like you should have left the note. It's like, yeah. Perdón por pegarle al carro. <laughs> there you go. Uh, <laughs> okay, now give me the options. What will be your match? But I need you to create the complete sentence. Okay, don't tell me one A, two B, three C. No, say the teacher borrowed my favorite book and spilled coffee all over it. I think um, you should have spoken to him about it. Something like that, right? Just make the complete sentence. <laughs> Number one, uh -huh. number one. Okay, Jesus, help me with number one. The teacher borrowed my favorite book and spilled coffee all over it. Uh -huh. 
Uh, you should have spoken to him about it. You should have spoken to him about it. Very good. Who can help me with number two? Me. Go ahead. I saw a classmate cheer. I don't know. Cheating. I saw. Yeah, I saw a classmate cheating on an exam. So I wrote her a letter about it. I will have written for the owner. No, no, no. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't have anything. I wouldn't, <laughs> I wouldn't, have, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't say anything. I wouldn't have said anything. Mm -hmm. What will you what will you match it with another one? Do you have any other option? Alguien que tenga otra opción? Because Edgar says oh. I wouldn't have said anything. The, the G one, I think it is. Uh -huh. You should have warned her not to do it to do it again. You should have warned her not to do it again. That's good, but uh, I will have spoken to the teacher about it. I will have said that to the teacher. Yo me veré directo al teacher. But that's my, that's my, uh, because I am a teacher, right? I will say like, look, look, she's cheating on the exam. <laughs> but that's a good option. Very good, Edgar. Number three, who can help me with number three? Number three, a friend of mine. A friend of mine always has messy hair. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. A messy hair. So I gave him a comb for his birthday. Birthday, birthday. Uh -huh, you. A comb for his birthday. Yes. What do you think? It's the correct match. Uh -huh. People, help Jesus. What option do you think is the, the appropriate one for that one? Um. I finished letter B, teacher. I will have told her that I prefer something else because. But it's him. Si tu amigo anda con el pelo desarreglado todo el tiempo, I think the best option is you should have spoken to him about it. It's like, hey, peinate. <laughs> so you should have spoken to him about it. It's like, it is better to say like, hey, you have this and this problem than to say like, eh, come on, peine. So, y si jugamos a peinar, no? <laughs> so, <laughs> that would be like, you should have spoken to him about it, right? Good. Y si jugamos a ponernos perfume? <laughs> So that's good, right? You should have spoken to him about it. Number four, I hit someone's car. What is the best option? When I was parking, uh huh. What would you say? What would be the match? B. Letter B. I. I will have to tell her that I will prefer something else. Okay, in this case, it's like, yo le hubiera dicho que preferiría algo diferente. And in the option says, eh, I hit someone's car, le pegué al carro de alguien cuando me estaba saliendo del parqueo, pero nadie me vio. <laughs> what option would you, do you think it's the correct one? Ajá. <laughs> Give me the sentence. Said anything. B, B for five. Letter D. D. I wouldn't have said anything. My God. No, si no dijo nada, solo se fue. You should have left a note to the owner. Adios, compañeros. Nos vemos. Hasta mañana. Okay, a dormir. Ya es hora de dormir. Hace una hora. <laughs> Era hora de so you should have left a note to the owner, people, right? I wouldn't have said anything. She didn't say anything. She said, luckily, no one saw me. Gracias a Dios que nadie me vio. So 
she escaped. Run so away. she ran away. So you should have left left a note to the owner, right? My aunt gave me a cigarette lighter for my birthday, but I don't smoke, so I gave it back to her. I will have told her that I prefer something else. Ting, ting, ting. Yes. In that case, yes. So, in that case, it is a be it is the best option, right? Mira, yes. tía, mejor otra cosa, right? Mejor de mal pisto. <laughs> so, <laughs> because you are not going to use it. Very good. So, different situations. Different situations. Uh, imagine that uh, you say, my mother lectured me because I didn't go to school, but I don't like the school. What would be the best situation? Okay, she lectured me because I didn't go to school, but I don't like the school. I would prefer to ask her to give me a to-do list. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I would prefer to give me a to-do list. Uh -huh. ¿Qué, ¿Qué hubiera hecho yo? Yo no iba a la escuela porque no me gustaba. You should have... What? How would you say? You should have talked to your mother. Hubiera hablado con ella, right? You should have talked to your mother. You should have said that in this case. So we make different uh, different options and i will write the sentence here you should i you should have talk uh, with your mother and that's the first option you should have talked to your mother or with your mother Right. What is another option that you can give me? Oops. I give you another option. Uh, you should. Uh, you should have a change. Mm -hmm. uh, your uh, your change your uh, your 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 what? Um, this you shall have it's hey. skewed <sighs> Yeah, you should my, change your school. <laughs> my, my school. Your behavior. You should have changed your behavior. Right? Like, que, que rebelde. Cambie el, el comportamiento, right? You should have changed your behavior. Uh -huh. your, you should have changed your school. Your school. My your, school. Your ah, schedule. Schedule. My schedule. My schedule. schedule. You, you should. You should have changed your schedule. Uh -huh. Change your schedule okay you should have changed your schedule you have you should have your uh, you sh you should have changed your uh, your turno the shift the shift you, uh -huh. should, you should have changed your shift shift el turno right no i didn't like the school in general because it was only for girls and I didn't like it. <laughs> That's why. No me gustaba, era solo para niñas. Así que me iba a leer al parque. <laughs> I didn't go. Yeah, I used to do that in seventh grade. Yeah, my mother thought that I was at school and I was reading in the park all the day. And then when it was time to go back home, I used to close the book and go back like normal, right? Toda la mañana me la echaba ahí sentada en el parque leyendo. <laughs> And I didn't go to school. It was like for one week. I did that for one week until my mother discovered me. Mm. And I was like, Ash. I didn't like the school. De ahí me puso en microbus y el microbus me entraba a dejar a la escuela y me entraba a traer a la escuela. So, 
I was a rebel, but I loved, I loved to read, so that's why. It was more exciting to go and read. So, no regrets. What is the meaning of regret, people? Arrepentimiento. Exactly, like, I, I should have. I should have married my first girlfriend. I should have studied English before. I should have entered to Inglés Corporativo in the pandemic. I should have met Teacher Nati before. <laughs> so what are some regrets that you can tell me, even if it's true or not? Invent one or mention one, right? Write it on your notebook. ¿Qué es algo de lo que nos arrepentimos? I should have... I should have bought a car many years ago. I should, should have done more exercise in quarantine. I should have done more exercise in quarantine, okay? So, write your regret and I am going to call the attendance, okay? Lo voy a dejar escribiendo su, su... Piensen acerca de un arrepentimiento que tengamos. O que podríamos haber hecho mejor antes. So, and I will call the attendance, meanwhile, okay? Let's see. Let me see. Teacher, yes. yes. I should have done more exercise. I should have done more exercise. Or I should have exercised more. I should have exercised more. No Let's see. Yeah, I was like, I shouldn't have eaten that much bread in pandemic. <laughs> Okay, I shouldn't have said that, you say. No hubiera dicho nada. I shouldn't have said that. But it gives you problems, right? Okay, I will call the attendance meanwhile. Alejandra? Alejandra Beatriz? Yes. Angelica Yamilet? Cecilia de Los Angeles? Ceci! Cesar Guadalupe? Here, teacher. I think, okay. Uh, Edgar Abel? I'm here, teacher. Edson Stanley? Edson escribió en el WhatsApp pidiendo permiso. Okay, thank you very much. El, Eduardo Jose? Present teacher. Thank you. Elvira? Present teacher. Ever Ernesto? Present teacher. Isabel? Present teacher. Jenny Elizabeth? Here. Thank you. Here, 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 teacher. Jeremias. Present teacher. Joana Yesenia. Present teacher. Jose Daniel. Present teacher. Jose Fernando. Present teacher. Karen Stephanie. Present teacher. Catherine Alejandra. Present teacher. Catherine Steph. Uh, sorry. No, Catherine Alejandra. It's okay. Miguel Angel. Present, present. Nidia Esmeralda. Present teacher. Raúl de Jesús. Present teacher. Reina Elizabeth. Present teacher. Samuel Isaac. Thank you. Sandra Leticia. Present teacher. And Jancy Astrid. I am here, teacher. Thank you very much. Okay, very good. Thank you for the ones who wrote in the chat. Present, present teacher. Very good. So like, sorry teacher, I am here listening. Cecilia, yes, I, I mark you here. Good, very good. So regrets before we go on the conversations. Regrets, Edgar. I shouldn't have to tell my secret to my best friend. <laughs> I shouldn't have told, I shouldn't have told. Oh. My, my secret, secret to my best friend. My best friend. No, yeah. Ni todo el amor, ni todo el dinero, ni todos los secretos. <laughs> Good. Jesus. Uh, I shouldn't have drink too much soda. <laughs> I shouldn't have drank. Drunk. Okay. Drink, drunk, drunk, drunk with you. I, I, shouldn't, I shouldn't have, have drunk, drunk too much soda. Very good. Isabel. Mm, I should have slept more time. I should have slept more. Yes. 
when I was younger. <laughs> Joanna? I should, uh, I should have studied a career. I should have studied a career. It is never too late. Studied, yeah. It is never too late. I should have studied a career. Todavía, nunca es tarde, Joana, vamos. Okay, sure. You, you can do it, yeah. Yo tuve un alumno que tenía 78 años y me dijo, teacher, no me quiero morir sin hablar inglés. And he learned, and he finished the advanced program, and he graduated. So, and he died uh, speaking English. But he, but he made his dream come true. No, he's still alive. Yeah, ahí anda todavía, tiene como 90 ya. Sigue dando guerra. <laughs> He's very active. Yeah. Sandra, tell me. The microphone, Sandrita. Sorry. <laughs> um, I should sure have bought a husky dog. It's very expensive. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. You shouldn't have or you should have? I, sh uh, I should have. Okay, I should have. De debía haberlo hecho. Alejandra? I shouldn't have ate a lot of food after sleep. I shouldn't have eaten. I shouldn't have eaten. Okay. Yes, before sleep. Before sleep. Okay. Before sleep. Yeah, porque si comes after sleep. Mm. Sí, ay, <laughs> like, <laughs> well, it, it happens. Under, it happens, sí. right? <laughs> un, un sleepwalker, right? <laughs> Finding something to it. Eduardo Jose, tell me. I should practice more and sport that I don't practice anymore right now. Okay, I should have practiced more sports. Cesar Guadalupe. I should have studied more English language in high school. I should have studied more English in high school. You see, cuando decían, ay, la clase de inglés ni voy a entrar. <laughs> My dear student, Karen. I should have studied English when I was 10 years old. Yes, I should have studied English when I was 10 years old. Yes. Yeah, I recommend you that. Jose Daniel? I should have studied English when I was young. When I was younger, right? That's why I always say, right? Si no lo hicimos nosotros, do it with your kids, okay? I am teaching my kid to speak English. I mean, I, and I have been doing that for four years, and he's five. So, teach English to your kids. Nidia Esmeralda. Um, I have all the university engineer. Okay, I should have studied civil engineer at university. Good, Jancy. Uh, I shouldn't eat bread and I should to sleep eight hours. I shouldn't have eaten bread. So I shouldn't have eaten bread and I should have slept eight hours. Yes. Okay. Jenny. I should have studied English uh, during pandemia because I didn't work. <laughs> you, you should have studied English during the pandemic. Good. I was the time. Uh, you had the time. You say I had the time. No, I was. I wasted, I wasted, I wasted my time. No, it is not wasted, but it is like, yeah, you should have done it, right? But it's not, it's not too late. It is never, it is never late to do it. Very good. Reina Elizabeth. Um, I should have saved a lot of money before. I should have saved a lot of money before. Yes. 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 No estaría en esta situación. Yeah. Well, yes. Ah, pero cuando lo tenemos, póngale aguacate. Deme de chicharrón chopi, la pupus. Chopi, no, chopi, chopi. chopi. Yeah, but yeah. Anyway, lo gastado, lo gastado, lo bailado y lo comido, nadie se lo quita. José Fernando. I uh, should study, study English more because it's difficult for me. I, I should have studied English more, right? 
Catherine Alejandra. I should have buy what I wanted. I should have bought. I should have bought what bought. I wanted. Good, what Miguel Angel. Thank you, Catherine. Okay, in my case, uh, I shouldn't eat uh, so red ribs uh, for my health. Okay, I shouldn't have eaten, right? Red meats, good, because of your health. Let's see, Ceci. I think Ceci is working, right? And Elvira as well. Samuel? Samuel Isaac, también working, come on. Jeremías? Eh, qué hombres más trabajadores. Ever? I should have think more when I choose my my major. Okay, you should have thought more when you chose your major, right? It is a big decision, right? It is a big decision when you start studying, but it is oh, it is always like good and necessary to do it. Okay, my dear students, I am going to make the little groups for you to work and you can present your little conversation. Let's see, Edgar, who were your classmates? It's Raul Benitez and Alejandra Beatriz. Edgar, Raul, let's see, and Alejandra. Okay, very good. Now, the next one, let's go with Isabel. Who were your classmates? Um, Ever. Isabel, Ever, and? And, oh, quiero ver. Eduardo. Eduardo. Yeah. <laughs> Eduardo Melgar. Good. Let's see. Sandra, who were your classmates? Sandra? Joanna uh -huh. and Reina. Joanna and Reina. Good. Let's see. Karen, who were your classmates? Jenny and Yancy. Jenny and Jancy. Good. Very good. Miguel, who were your classmates? Miguel Angel, ¿con quién ibas en el grupo? Um, no me recuerdo. Si... <gasps> who was with Miguel eh, Angel? Espérame, espérame, espérame. espérame. Eh, iba con, con José Daniel. Ajá. No José Daniel en. Y Samuel Isaac. And Samuel Isaac, very good. Let's see, let's go with the next one. Cecilia, who was your partner? ¿Quién ibas con Cecilia? Or Cesar Guadalupe, ¿con quién ibas? Nidia and Edson, but Ned, Edson is not here. Yes, okay, let me see. I will, I will do it again. Uy, sorry. Cesar and... Nidia. Nidia, okay. I will add another one. Nidia, and Edson is not here. Okay, so I will move you here. I will continue with uh, Elvira or let's say Catherine. With Elvira and Jose Fernando. And Jose, okay, good. There you go. And Ceci was with, con quien was Ceci? Bueno, la vamos a dejar aquí para que entre al, al salón. Ok, so I will open the rooms for you to go and talk and practice. Ok, I will go and visit each of them. Ok, voy a ir a visitarlos a todos para que hagan su conversación. Go ahead. Excellent. 
accept my invitations, please. Thank you. Okay, Ceci, Samuel and Miguel, can you accept my invitations to go to the groups, please? Thank you. Yeah, Ceci, I know you are working, don't worry. Uh, but in the case of uh, Miguel? Teacher me mandó a otro grupo, me mandó. Okay, ahorita veo. Estaba con Daniel y Manuel. No, ahí está con él. No sé. Sí. Cecilia. Okay. Es la cinco. Cecilia dice. No, es que ahorita se me ha quedado en la sala principal. Ah, ok. Ok, espérenme, lo, lo voy a sacar y él me recibe la invitación cuando le salga a las cinco, ok? Gracias. Okay. Ahorita, Miguel. La, ahí está. Ahí está, las cinco. Go ahead. ¿Y Samuel? Oh, Samuel is working. Okay. So I am going to go and check your friends on... Don't, don't worry, Samuel. I know you're working. I am going to go and check your friends. And so I will come back in a moment, okay? Thank you. You are going to plan something more? Alejandra, absolutely, Edgar. For my next vacation, I'm going to read a book. And you, and what about you, Benitez? Ella te pregunta yeah, a ti. I'm going to stay at the Cameron for three days. Uh, uh, I'm enjoying with my family. Oh, oh. Luego voy yo. Okie dokie. Raúl Benito. No, I have some time. No, I have some minutes to talk. You know. Hey, we should go out this weekend. Do you think? Oh, I cannot. I'm going to study for the exam this weekend. Really? We deserve to have a free time instead. Really, you cannot come with us? Uh, I know, but I really had to start for the exam, guys. I want to pass with flying colors. Oh, come on, Isa. The grades are not on the line. I know, but I cannot go with you. Oh, that's bad. But how about you, Ever? I'm free. Where will we go? Mm, I'm going to come to the university in the morning and I will be free in the afternoon. Why don't you come home and play video games? Oh, that sounds great. I will go to your home in the afternoon and I will bring pizza with me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hi, Sandra, how are you? I'm fine, thanks. Tell me, what do you plan for this weekend? On the weekends, I'm going to visit my friend Sonia. I read motorcycle. What about you? Do you plan for this weekend? Yes, on Saturday, I'm going to the church. I'm going to go to the church with my family. And at night, maybe I will visit my relatives oh. do the homework um, with my son, uh, clean the house, and I'm going to wash the 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 cloth, and just that. Uh, and look, it's late, and I have a meeting. So, see you tomorrow, guys. See you later. Karen Bye, and Jenny. See you later. 
Okay, good. So you have your conversation ready, right? Ready and rolling. <laughs> yeah, we are ready. Okay, perfect. <laughs> but we are practicing. No, practice. Practice again. Don't worry. I will yeah. come back <laughs> because I am visiting all the rooms. Okay, thank you. Go. Aha. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Boo, hello. Estamos hablando que nos obligan a sacar la mascota. <laughs> Which one? Yeah. Entonces es una de las actividades que hacemos. I will go past. Uh, I, I will, I will, I will walk the dog. You say I will walk the dog. Ah, por eso es caminar, ya pasear, pas. No, that is the, that is the, the phrase in English. When you say I will walk the dog, sacarlo a pasear, sacar a pasear al perro. Okay. That is the phrase. I will walk the dog. Uh -huh. Yes. That is the, the, the option. I don't take my dog out because she's very crazy. No like. No, I mean, I can't. She's very crazy. As she's very big, ah. she's, she's very like, ah, ah, ah. And so <laughs> it, it is dangerous because she breaks the chains, right? Todas las cadenas, la revienta. And then I am running behind the dog and she's like, Ah, escaping from me and I'm like Kiara, Kiara. It's so, all therapy. No, she's she's very, very like it's hyperactive. Yeah, but I cannot do it. So that's <laughs> something that I cannot enjoy, right? Say sí, cadena que compro, cadena que revienta. So it's very depende horrible. La clase, depende la clase de I, I no, she's a she's a boxer dog. So she's oh, a no, no. she's a big animal. And I have bought no, even... una cadena de, de las que ponen en los parqueos. Eso no va a... <laughs> <laughs> and the dog. <laughs> yeah, I, ha I have tried. Believe me, I will do it. <laughs> I will do it. Yeah, because it's very difficult with her. And she's just like walking. She looks at me and then she just pulls the chain and she escapes. Yeah, she's like, no, 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 no. Thank you, thank you, but no, thank you. Okay, I will go to the next room. Practice your conversation, please. Practice, practice. I will come back. Okay. Practice. Great. So say you. Hello, hello. 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 Uh huh. How is the? How are you going with the conversation? <laughs> I love your answer. Was like, eh, 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 eh. 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 Elvira, Elvira is doing a, a meeting at yeah. her work. She's working right now. She's working. Yes. But at least you are going to be ready for tomorrow, right? Yes. Okay. Ya para mañana la a tener lista, vea. I guess, yeah. <laughs> I guess you will, yes, yes. <laughs> I guess you will have it, right? Good, yeah. very good. So let's go back to the main room because I need to give you a couple of, of um, uh, announcements and then we're going to, to finish. Okay, let's go back. There. Okay, thank you. Welcome back. Welcome, welcome. Hello, hello. Okay, I, I love the answer. It's like, are you ready with the conversation? <laughs> <laughs> I remember that one forever. <laughs> I will remember that. I have many things in, in, in my teaching career that I remember. That would be one of them. Ever? Yes? The insecurity. <laughs> yeah, when, when you are not sure about it. Ever, you have your hand up, sweetie. What do you want? Eversito? Ah, my mic is fake. Ah, yeah, yeah. But you need to fix it for tomorrow, right? <laughs> no hay salvación. 
<laughs> you need to fix it. Tomorrow, for your final oral evaluation, you are going to, uh, to uh, do the oral presentation, right? That is the conversation. In this case, Ever wants to do it today. So you can do it today. So Ever's group. Ever's group. Let me see. It's Ever, Eduardo, and Isabo. Let me fix my microphone, he says. Okay. Good. People. Important. I need you to do something uh, before everything that it's very important. I need you to do the following. On your platform, you have one space that says progress. I need you to go there and I need you to take a picture of the bars of the progress. So you can actually show me that you finish with everything on the platform. Okay, I am going to show you a couple of examples. I am going to show you a couple of examples of what the other people, eh, around two minutes or one minute. Eh, someone is asking about the length of the conversation. It's like two minutes, two or three minutes. So let me show you. I need you to go to the section of progress in the platform where you have these little bars and I need you to take a picture of it. And I need you to send me the picture of the progress of the platform. That should be done completely, right? Like this. We are sending you in the WhatsApp teacher. Yes, in the WhatsApp group. So everybody in English Corporativo can check that you have already finished. Okay. Cuando los eh, facilitadores de English Corporativo entren a revisar, vean que todos ustedes ya han terminado con su progreso. Okay. Así ya todos tenemos prueba de que mire, aquí está, yo ya terminé. Ahí estamos listos todos con todo. Si a alguno de repente le ha quedado un ejercicio ahí con menos de 100, let me know and I can help you. Edgar, yes? Okay, my fellows and I, I, we are ready to do the conversation. To do the conversation. Yeah. But, uh, well, it is almost time to finish. We are going okay. to have a uh, Mr. Ever. Please. Yeah. Because they, they want to do it can today. You, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Okay. I already fixed my, my microphone. Thank okay. you. Okay, Ever, who is your your other? Oh, our Isabel and Eduardo. Isabel. Okay. And Eduardo. I'm going to go with Eduardo. Eduardo Jose. Yeah. There you go. Action. Okay. Ellos van a hacer nuestro ejemplo para mañana. Check it out. Okay. Hello, Ever. How are you? Hello, Isabel. I'm great. How about you? I'm tired. The university is getting hard. Yeah, I know. Oh, look, there is Eduardo. Hello, Eduardo. Hi, guys. What's going on? We are tired of the university. Oh, I know. I have a mad exam now. Now it's my kind of late. No, I have some minutes to talk. You know, hey, we should go out this weekend. What do you think? Oh, I cannot. I'm going to study for the exam this weekend. Really? We deserve to have a free time, Isa. Really, you cannot come with us? I know, but I really have to study for the exam, guys. I want to pass with flying colors. Oh, come on, Isa. The grades are not all, are not all in the life. I know, but I cannot go in with you. Uh, that's so bad. But what about you, Ever? I'm free. Where will we go? Mm, I'm going to come to the right. university in the morning, and I will be free in the afternoon. Why don't you come home and play video games? Great. I will go to your home in the afternoon and I will be, bring pizza with me. Pizza and video games? I think I will go too. I want to start today all night to can go this weekend with you guys. Really? That's so amazing. We will have a fantastic weekend. 
By the way, I'm going to math right now and I'm late. See you later. Okay, see you this weekend then. Great, see you guys. Hey. <laughs> Hey, very very awesome. claps for your friends. Very good job. Good job. Very good job. You did a fantastic job, my dear students. That sounds great. You see, Isabel was like, no, I don't want to go because I have to study ah, pizza and video games. Where? Me? <laughs> I have... <laughs> write my name there. Congratulations. You did a very fantastic job. So thank you very much for being the example well it is time to go my dear students it is time to go but tomorrow we are going to finish with this make sure that uh, you practice and we are going to be working on this tomorrow for the rest of the groups so please keep uh, notes of the groups i am going to save it Okay, I'm going to save it here. And uh, we're going to do this tomorrow as soon as we start, okay? And then we are going to enjoy our last class tomorrow. It will be nice, okay? I have a couple of uh, tips for you. Have a wonderful night and I'm going to see you tomorrow, my dear students. Okay, see you and take night care. Night, teacher. Bye. 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 B